add a frequency factor to your computation, you'll go to the drainage and utilities workflow, the analysis tab, and then under calculation, you'll select options. And these are your different calculation options. So I'll double click on the base analysis. And this is all of the different settings for how the calculation is done. And I want to go to this rational method. This is where the frequency factor is. So use the rational method frequency factors. Right now it's set to false. So if I double click and set to true, then I have different frequency factors. So I can click this ellipses right here. So average recurrence interval, let's say it's 100 year, and the multiplier will be 1.25. And I'll click OK to add it. And you can see in the help, I'm in the subsurface utilities help, analysis, calculation, calculation options, option attributes, frequency factors. This is the formula it's using. So it's creating an, ad an adjusted runoff coefficient for the rational method. And it's the runoff coefficient times this frequency factor. So this is, in a sense, a bulk update to adjust the runoff coefficient for a larger storm event, such as a 100-year storm.